Dragonborn, good to see you. Is there something you need? You wanted to see me? Ah, yes, Dragonborn. I hate to involve you with more of our problems, what is it, but I have no choice. My king, my a few my days ago, there was an assassination attempt against King Lokan and Queen Alicia whilst they were walking outside of the Longhouse. It would have succeeded had a guard not noticed the assassin and quickly jumped in front of the arrow. Oh! Unfortunately, he was killed as the arrow was coated in a deadly poison, but we managed to kill the assassin before he struck again. We now need to figure out who hired them and arrest them in case of another attack. We would like your help as one impartial to Midwood Isle. Am I impartial though? Am I impartial if I've been helping you guys out this entire time? Where would I start? Excellent. That's a relief to hear. You're going to want to speak to Renly, who is leading the investigation, and assist him wherever you can. Okay. Don't even think about making a move on the King or Queen. After all this time, do you really think that I would be making a move against them? I'm aiding your investigation. What can I do to help? Ah, excellent. Sites and mention you might join us. I trust he's already explained things to you, so I'll get straight to it. I need you to go and check in with Garandra the Alchemist. We gave him some of the poison the assassin used for him to analyze. Let me know as soon as you've learned anything. Man, remember the last time we questioned a bandit? Remember how well that went? Okay, they're right here. I thought so, I just wanted to double check. Also, I know it's not a bandit. Is that fur coming out of your ears? I'm just remembering the last time we questioned someone that yes, though, was involved in an investigation. What do you need? Granted, you know, you're helping us with the investigation, so I don't know why I would think that you're gonna die. What have you found out about the assassin's poison? Well, I've managed to identify the main ingredients. Troll fat, small antlers, and red mountain flower. When combined, they create a powerful poison. Is that true? I do recall selling these particular ingredients to an individual not too long ago. He was fairly short. A Bosmer. Had a shaved head and a scar on his forehead. He hasn't returned since. Hmm. Bosmer, bald, scar. Well, it doesn't match the description of anyone I know. The only Bosmer I know off the top of my head here is that prick of an archer who was in the archery tournament, who can't lose gracefully. Any news from Garadra? He sold the ingredients of the poison to a Bosmer, shaved with a forehead scar. Damn it, that description matches the assassin we killed. Welp, my king. I also queen, have news. I While you were gone, to to we you. searched the body and Go found a hefty something. coin purse and a dagger poisoned like well, the arrow. I've noticed a drop the coin purse proves he was working for someone, whereas the dagger could prove useful to us. What's causing it? Durden makes all the weapons my around here. Take it to him and see if he knows I anything about it. Feel brave enough to transport goods Do you think it's tied to... to... So, I'm gonna get his name wrong. Do you think it's tied to Valdiel at all? Only trading because Valdiel did something similar. He had a dagger that was poisoned, the scent assassins. Like, it really seems similar. What if this was his contingency in case he died? Hmm. Sorry to wake you. Sorry to break into your home and wake you, but have you seen this dagger before? Hmm. It looks like a standard dagger, but its steel is different to anyone I know makes. I've never seen it before. It must be made by someone not from here. Oh. <laughs> okay. <gasps> Skyforge steel. Wait. 
What if it's Skyforge Steel? I don't think it is, but... <gasps> it's a steel dagger. What if it is Skyforge Steel and... Me setting up the trade route for this is what allowed the assassin to poison the dagger. I'm probably getting ahead of myself, but what if? I find your wolfish king. I protect my I'm king and queen with my life. You better not get in their way. And that's why the courier didn't come to me until after I did that quest. Dearden has never seen the dagger. He says it was made by someone not from here. Hmm, that's interesting. I'll look into it and see if I can find out anything else. In the meantime, I need you to ask around town if anyone has heard anything. But I don't want to alert the assassin employer of our investigation. I suggest you speak to Arninan, the innkeeper. He's been a friend for years, and I trust him. And he hears a lot of rumors at the inn. I realize I immediately went for the most grandiose explanation or reasoning behind what's going on here. Although I guess it wasn't that grandiose. It's like, oh, this dagger came to Midwood Isle after I tournament. set up the trade deal I'm between Skyrim and Midwood Isle. It was a steel dagger, which could be a complete coincidence, but, you know, maybe there's something to it. Welcome to the Dragon Meat Inn. If you need anything, just ask. All because I want to find quests that take me to the other island. Welcome to the Dragon Meat Inn. Care for a drink, or perhaps a warm bed? What if I wanted a warm drink and a cold bed, huh? Can you provide me with that? Renly wanted me to ask if you've heard anything suspicious recently. Hmm. I must say, I don't think I have. But if you really want to know if anything is happening, ask Ned Hill. He spends a lot of time outside now, so he would be more likely to know something. He spends a lot of time outside because he's homeless. Oh, but now he's more sober, so... Need something? What, what if this all just was a culmination of the other quests no, I have no, done? Glad to see. Oh god, everyone's you? yelling in my ear. What if this was a culmination of everything? Helping him be less drunk. Doing the quest to get Skyforge weapons here. Like I said, probably getting ahead of myself, but a man can dream, a man can imagine, and then come up with crazy conspiracy theories. Did you need something? Do you still drink as much as you used to? Not at all. I only go to the inn once a week or so, and I hardly buy anything in there anyway. I found that once I'm not spending as much gold on me, I can afford to buy other things. Not a house, though. I thank you, my friend. If not for you, I'd be spending all my time and money there. Have you heard or seen anything suspicious recently? Hmm. Normally, I'd charge for this, but as a personal favor to you, I'll tell you for free. I have heard odd noises coming from the abandoned house outside the West Gate at night. They may even be there tonight, if you're lucky enough. Ooh. There we go. At midnight. Oh, we have time. I was worried it was going to be too late. But no, we got time. I don't even remember there being an abandoned house. Did that just get added recently? Oh. I thought he meant a house I could actually go inside of. Like a real house, not a burnt down house. Alright, let's wait here till midnight. Alright, it's 11.55. Detected by who? <laughs> oh, okay, they just wanted me to be in here. Oh, they just wanted me. Oh, oh, there he is. There he is. Bloody woman. Makes me walk miles, but can't even walk outside the city herself. Wait. <gasps> Wait. A woman. Wait, why didn't we just confront him? 
That's my question. <laughs> Why didn't I confront him? I just sat there. And let him leave. All we know now is that there's another assassin, and that that assassin was hired by a woman. Hmm. Well, Renly, we have an update for you at least. You see those warriors from Hammerfell? They've got curved swords. Curved what is it? Swords. I've got a job to do. The Hierer is still at large. It's a woman who lives in Florin. Wow, great work. I also found something as well. The dagger was Skyforged steel. Aha! Uh -huh. That's why Durden didn't recognize it. I called it! It was obviously designed to throw us off, but thanks to you, we know it wasn't someone from Skyrim after all. I don't suppose you know any traders who bring in Skyforged uh, steel, do you? Mm. They might know who brought the dagger from them. Uh, <laughs> Eastloft. I helped Tim set up trade with Midwood Isle. I'm kind of responsible now. Excellent. Go and speak to this Eastloft and see if he sold any daggers to anyone privately. Oh, I feel bad now. Granted, they probably still would have tried to kill the king and queen regardless of this, but still, I feel complicit. Am I responsible? No. Do I feel responsible? Yes. Your book is flying away. Did it come from your stall? I guess so. It's funny, because I was saying, oh, I don't really care about this Skyforge Steel quest, and now... It laid the groundwork for this. Just think. Think if the assassin had been successful. Think if the king and queen had died. Then I would have been guilty. Then I would have absolutely been the one in trouble for this. Got curved swords. Curved swords. Curved swords. Curved swords. The hammer fellas, they have the curved swords. Good day, friend. Of course. Get some rest. It's a long trip. Carved sards. Have you sold any Skyforge steel daggers to anyone other than Ankare? I... I have. Normally I shape all of my weapons to Ankare, but when I docked in Midwood Isle, a woman approached me. She wanted to buy a dagger and paid well, provided that I would keep this trade a secret. I normally don't go back on promises, but after hearing what happened, and since you asked, I had to tell you. She was fairly old, uh, had short black hair, and was blind in her right eye. Thank you. That's very helpful. You're welcome. Once again, I am very sorry for what happened. I will stick to my partner from now on. Cheating on your partner? See how it is. Oh, hi. Divine smile on you, friend. You were ready for me. You were waiting for me to go back. Well, thank you. Of course. Get some rest. It's a long trip. Yes, Dovakin. How can I help you? Watch yourself around the king and queen. Don't even think about making a move on the king or queen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They really need to update that line from him. <laughs> Eastlaf told me a woman bought a dagger off him in secret. Did he? That must be our hirer then. Did he say what she looked like? She was old, had short black hair, and was blind in her right eye. Hmm. That description matches Indrith. She lives on the west side of the city. It makes perfect sense. She always seemed unhappy, but I never suspected she'd plan something like this. Look, unfortunately, we can't just arrest her based on your word alone. Oh. We need evidence. Evidence that proves she's guilty. Search her house and see what you can find. Be careful, though, as we can't convict her yet, so you'll be treated as a criminal if you're seen. Hmm. Do I do it in the middle of the night while she's asleep, or do I do it during the day when she would leave home? If I do it at night, she might be meeting with the assassin. 
Hmm. I wish someone knew her schedule. I wish someone could tell me what her schedule is. Oh, that dog's gonna rat on me if I break in. Oh, the dog doesn't see me good. Is she home? Oh, she's home. Nothing. Nothing. Be very, very quiet. Traveler's Guide to Midwood Isle? No. No. Nothing. Oh my god. I'm also a semi-light sleeper myself. So I would probably get woken up if someone came into my house. We have to stop any further meetings, as it is becoming dangerous for me to be seen out at night. Somehow they have caught onto our plans, but do not know our identities yet. You should stay hidden at the shack between Lundin and Florin until further notice. Aha! Uh -huh. She's gonna wonder where that letter is in the morning, but... Well, <laughs> we don't really have any other option. No, dog, don't, no, 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 dog, dog, don't do that. Don't do that. Oh! And this dog's Julianos! We got Akatosh over in Alverton, Alverton, and then we have Julianos here. Aw. Those are some good boys. I want Stendar as a dog. Do you think Sarah would let me name our dog Stendar? Or one of our dogs, because we've already decided on the name for the first dog. It's Moose. Don't even think about making a move on the King or Queen. Alright, you need new lines. You really do. I found this letter at Indrith's house. Let me see that. Yes, this is clear now. It's her. This is enough evidence to convict her and put her away for good. Now, this letter says the assassin she was hiring is hiding in a shack between here and Lundin. Whilst we arrest Indrith, could you go and attempt to arrest the assassin? With someone as dangerous as him, you may deem it necessary to kill him. Alright, find where the assassin is hiding. Who are you? And what are you doing here? You're under arrest for conspiracy to commit murder. Ha! You really think I'll go with you? You fool. I'll kill you. You're gonna need a bigger knife. Oh! <laughs> Why did I say that? He had a bigger knife! I mean, not that it really mattered, but... Still. Man. <laughs> what are the odds? You're gonna need a bigger knife. Has sword ready to go. I was just checking to see if he had anything here. Uh, no, not really. I do miss the old Cyrodiilic style for ebony weapons. Honestly, that looks like a direct port from Oblivion. Which is both a good thing and a bad thing. <laughs> Alright. Let's head back. And the irony in all this is that I've done two quests now to try and find quests for the new island. And I still haven't found a single quest in regards to the new island. These might just be side quests from the mod even before the update for all I know. I really can't tell. Any luck finding the assassin? Yeah, he's dead. I found him, but had to kill him. I suspected as much. Indrith too refused arrest, forcing us to kill her. But enough of that. This ordeal is finally over. Largely thanks to you. We have no motivation? I couldn't have done it without you. You should be the one to tell the king the good news. I'm sure he'll be relieved he can step outside again. No motivation, nothing else tied to this? That's so interesting. 
Interesting as in, it's a little weird to me. Is that fur coming out of your ears? Hi. Welcome to Florin, Dragonborn. If you How need can anything, please talk to Siphon. He will be able to help you with whatever you need. Your Majesty, the threat against your life is resolved. Ah, <sighs> what a relief off my chest. I, I can't thank you enough for everything you've done for us. A few coins hardly seems like enough. So I am granting you my amulet and the position of Thane of this island. Ooh! It is one of the highest positions that is in my power to give. I'll also notify the guards of your new title. You'll find they'll be a bit more cordial with you in the future. Once again, Dragonborn, I thank you. Should you ever need help, all in Midwood Isle shall stand with you. No, you'll always find friends here. Take that scythe and telling me that I'm... Impartial to Midwood Isle. I'll show him. Dragonborn, good to see you. Is there something you need? Oh, here we go. Is the ruined house available to buy? Why, yes. Yes, it is. We'd be honored to have you own property in Midwood Isle, Dragonborn. After all you've done for us. I'll even give the land away to you for a discount, since it's you. Aw, oh, shucks. I'll take it. Excellent. Here is the key to your new home. It's not much at the moment, but with a bit of building and work, I think it can really be something. I'd like to rebuild my house. 5,000 gold? Yeah. Very well. I'll make the arrangements. The next time you visit your house, that should be done for you. I'd like to decorate my home. I'll be glad to help you. What would you like to purchase? Uh... Renovate? Very well. I'll make the arrangements. The next time you visit your house, that should be done for you. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Clear the cellar? Very well. I'll make the arrangements. The next time you visit your house, that should be done for you. And... Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Frankly, no mannequins, because I hate mannequins. Add lights to the cellar. Very well, I'll make the arrangements. The next time you visit your house, that should be done for you. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Uh... Add an alchemy laboratory to the cellar, add an enchanting laboratory, add smithing equipment. Let's go with smithing equipment. Very well, I'll make the arrangements. The next time you visit your house, that should be done for you. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Nope, I think we're all set. Blessings be with you. And also you. Ooh, do I get a, a fast travel point for my house? It looks like it. And I'm just outside the city limits as well. Well, not really outside the city limits, I'm outside the city wall. Okay. You know, it's just a basic house, but frankly, that's all I really need. Oh, yeah, they want me to add all the different smithing, or not smithing, all the different crafting types here. <laughs> okay, I'm not crazy about the design. It being all the exact same rock texture is a little... That eh, just feels a little repetitive. feels a little... Mm, I don't know the correct term for it. But, uh, I mean, it's a minor thing. It's me just being a little nitpicky, what can I say? Alright, well, neither of those quests had anything to do with the new island. So, it seems like if I want to do something with the new island, I have to just go there and explore myself. So, let's get to it.